Hi, I'm here with Tiffany Frierson. She's actually a student working on Project Icarus. What do your friends and family think about your involvement in Project Icarus? They're really excited, actually. Um, they, they're, pro they're happy that I'm doing something that's going to possibly contribute to humanity's knowledge. And um, they might not believe in space exploration them themselves, but um, overall, they're excited for me. That's really exciting. And, um, you know, since you're a student, what are your career goals? And have they changed since working on Project Icarus? Yes, actually. I met my, um, I met my mentor through Project Icarus. Uh -huh. And now I know, really know what I want to do with my life, which is propulsion physics. And um, you said propulsion physics. Yeah. That's a big deal. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Um, at first, I didn't know what I really, really wanted to do within physics, but now I do, and that's exciting. And um, you know, this is more of a personal question, but being hearing impaired does that affect your work at all, or not really? Um, yes, actually, uh, it's hard to hear the professors and things during class, but. Um, the thing is, I, I have to get my degree, and I want to get my degree, and so I have to push for it. And also, my mentor, my mentor is here in Paris also, uh -huh. and uh, he's been giving me a lot of advice and tips and things on how to proceed with my hearing impairment. That's really cool. And what do you think about going into space? Is it something, I mean, you're super young. Is it something you would want to do one day? I'm afraid of heights, but I think I can. <laughs> I think I can get over it to get into space. I mean, I really want to um, experience that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. Heights are a little scary. Well, congratulations on everything you've accomplished. Being a part of this project is a huge deal. So enjoy, you know, the entire conference, and thank you so much for talking with us. Thank you. Thank you.